I think it's important for our clients to know that we are not just selling a system. We are a partner in their process. And it starts with design. From the very first time that a sales engineer meets with them, we're listening to what they say. We're listening to what their requirements are. We know what questions to ask. We know when we're looking at the process and the process equipment, how it integrates into the clean room. We're following through with those drawings that come here that our takeoffs are correct because the customer has already said that design works for me. That's what I need for my process. That's critical. We want to make sure that's what we deliver. After the customer has approved the drawings, we'll get eyes on the project. We'll look at the scope, determine what the lead times need to be. Are there any long lead items? and then process work orders. When we receive the raw material in, it's staged on the racks in the back. When we have a project come in, ceiling panels, for instance. The sheet goods are cut to size, the ends are rolled form, and then those go through our glue machine. All the while that's taking place on one line, then we have the frames for the panel system itself being cut out in the extrusion department. Those items are cut to size, then those go to the welding department. They get welded up. Our aluminum honeycomb core is, is the filling for all of our systems. Uh, the doors have it, the ceilings, the walls have it. You have all these components coming together, kind of like an ice cream sandwich. Top skin goes on, goes into the press, comes out the back end, cleaned and prepped. Every single panel gets inspected, and then it goes to the crating department. And once it's crated, it's staged until it's ready to ship. I come from a high volume manufacturing environment. I've been with AES for two years now and I'm with Derek Jefferson. We're close together so that our guys know exactly what to cut, what sizes to cut, and what goes out with each project. On the processing side, we constantly have jobs coming in, design changes that are coming in. Uh, material goes to site, customer wants to make some adjustments. We have to accommodate that. Teamwork is critical. I can't stress that enough. Just to make everything happen as smoothly as possible. At any given time, we could be manufacturing up to six, seven projects at one time. Safety is always number one. We have weekly meetings with our crew. We do walkthroughs every day to make sure that everything is where it's supposed to be, no hazards. Every person on that floor is empowered at any time to stop a process if they see an unsafe situation. Creating that culture, we have good results. And a good result is we have not had an accident or incident in the past 24 months in this facility. At the factory, we are at the end of the line. So any questions that have to be answered have to be answered at this point. That's my driving force to make sure that we get absolute clarity on what's needed to make sure that the customer gets the correct product Right now, there are projects that are open in different stages in the factory. As the projects start to solidify, we'll then go through ordering materials, scheduling production, and as it comes to completion date, making sure that the site is ready, that we're shipping on time, and that everything is delivered as scheduled. 